So we're going to start off with this piece of uh, just a rod of steel. Uh, this one is about 10 millimeter diameter, but you can pretty much use whatever you like. It's just what I had. Um, obviously, this this process will be speeded up if you heat up the metal, but I don't have anything to do that right now. So we're just going to um, just hit it with a hammer and see if we can flatten that end out that end out there a bit to drill a hole. So so we'll get started. So for my wire that I'm going to be mainly working with, we've got a bit of number 8 here and a bit of, this is a high tensile sort of a stuff. So I'm only going to make two holes, typically these things have three in them, but I've got a drill bit that is going to fit, uh, that the number 8 is going to fit through and then another smaller one that the high tensile stuff is going to fit through. And I'm going to put a big, the big hole at the end here and then the other one, so the big, this drill bit's going there and then the other one just below it. So now what we've got is a couple of holes and the wire is going to fit through each each one. Um, now we're just going to cut that to a decent sort of a length, probably there somewhere, and then just clean up the burrs on the back here and then that's pretty much done. Okay, so as you can see here, I've set up your typical termination fencing knot. And now for some reason or another, you've left yourself without enough material to make a handle. So we'll snip that. And then you grab your twisting tool, put that over there like that, and then you've got enough leverage to twist it round now. Just like that and then you just snip off that edge if you wanted to just makes it a bit easier when you don't have enough to make a handle you've got enough um, to put this thing over and you can get it done
So you just saw me do it with the piece of that was high tensile stuff. This stuff's number eight. Same sort of thing, termination knot, for example, and you've left yourself not enough to make a handle. Snip that off. These are really good, by the way. Really, really loving these little mini bolt cutters by Nipex. Amazing. Anyway, get that little tool that we've made over there. Just gives you enough leverage to twist it round. Obviously the longer you make this, the easier it's going to be for you. Just like that. And you can snip that off, that bit off again at the bottom there. Um, now typically you'd want these real tight and close together, but I mean you can play around with it, have a bit more practice, you'll get the hang of it, but that'll do the trick for our, um, for our sake here. Sweet guys, so thank you for watching, and um, yeah, like it, subscribe to it. These, Gallagher I think makes these little things, you can buy them, it's not my design by any means, um, just a handy little extra tool to carry around with you when you're doing a bit of fencing, um, yeah, so try it out, cheers.